Two Duquesne Light employees are in the hospital tonight after they were hurt on the job today. Neighbors rushed outside when they heard a power surge. Jessica Gway is live where it happened in McCandless with the latest tonight. Jess. Well, Ken, the power is back on tonight, but neighbors are still shaken up and worried about the two line workers who are in the hospital. They were shocked while working on lines above this yard behind me. I've heard like transformers kind of explode before. Like you can just t tell that like high voltage like zap, you know, it's like a real powerful zap. Um, so that's when we knew something wasn't right. Greg Mel heard that loud noise around lunchtime. He couldn't believe what he saw right in his front yard. Came running outside. A gentleman was unconscious um, on the in the yard. Another guy was up in the um, bucket of the truck who was also kind of like unconscious. The two Duquesne light line workers were shocked by a live line as they worked to replace a utility pole on Brandywine Drive in McCandless. Mel says his next door neighbor, who's a nurse, did CPR on the worker in his yard. Thankfully, like, you know, she came over right away and, you know, just she knew exactly what to do with the chest compression. And Mel did what he could to help. I was just kind of standing next to the nurse, like, help hold his head. Uh, you could kind of see in his glove where it was still smoldering. Um, we didn't worry much to touch the power line. So, you know, we were really concerned for him, trying to say, like, hey, stay with us, you know, like, stay here. Another neighbor tells KDKA McCandless police used a defibrillator on the worker until ambulances arrived and Duquesne light crews filled the street. They came pouring in to help, uh, you know, their buddy. You know what I mean? And it just show, and they're very emotional and, uh, you know, just what you'd expect. Duquesne Light is investigating the cause of the incident along with OSHA, according to local leaders. I hope both of them, you know, recover fully and, you know, can, you know, get back to work and, you know, carry on with their lives. Duquesne Light said the two workers were rushed to local hospitals while waiting for an update on their conditions. Live in McCandless, Jessica Gway, KDKA News.